Just give me a moment while I do this real quick, and we will start the stream. Discord. Mm -hmm. I'm almost done, you guys. <laughs> Almost uh, finished. <laughs> Sorry if I'm taking a bit. I thought it was a dog at first, but it was Wu Kang in the game. Alright. Almost finished. I, I promise. <laughs> for mic check. <clears throat> okay. Check, check. Yep, we're good. Okay. All right. Oh, oh crap. Hang on, hang on a sec. Here we go. Alright. Hello everyone and welcome to the stream. 
My name is Hannah Powers, the HP 600, or you can call me Hannah, and today we are playing some Mortal Kombat XL for a chill and wholesome stream. And hello, Yoshi. It has been a while since I've seen you on, on the chats. <laughs> so yeah, today we are playing some Mortal Kombat XL for a chill and wholesome stream, like I said. Um, my next stream will be on Saturday, which uh, we will be playing episode 4 of Batman Telltale... Uh, the Enemy Within, aka Season 2. Um, we'll be playing Episode 4 of that on Saturday. And um, my next stream after that uh, will be on next Thursday at 4.30pm Central Time Zone, which we'll be playing uh, some Crash Team Racing Nitro Field, I think. So, yeah. Um, that's all I gotta say, so... Yeah, and also, guys, I'm finally 18. So my my birthday was two days ago, so I'm officially an adult now. Um, well, I'm still technically a teenager, kind of, but I'm also a, le a legal adult. So, yeah, fun stuff, am I right? And, whoops, sorry, I didn't mean to move the camera. Um, so, yeah, that's all I gotta say before I start the stream, so... Let's go ahead and start the game, shall we? And... Lin Kuei wins. I'm gonna turn this speaker on. Thank you, Yoshi. Uh, yep, big, a big 18. I'll be getting my tattoo on Wednesday next week. My first tattoo. Suggest a cinnamon roll with your meal. I'm gonna turn off the music real quick. About like here ish. Yep. <laughs> I can't believe I'm, f I'm officially 18 now. What's the tattoo gonna be? Um, it's gonna be a, um, uh, a Cyberlife Triangle from Detroit Become Human, and it's gonna have, a uh, blue blood splattered, and also purple blood, because purple's my favorite color, and because blue is obviously Ethereum, blue blood from the game. And under it, it's gonna say, hashtag HP600 Army, so that's, uh, how it's going to be. So yeah, I'm excited. <clears throat> and yes guys, I will be doing karaoke at 30 minutes. <laughs> Test your luck. Uh, I'll go ahead with Cassie Cage, shall we? Cassie Cage. Yeah, I'm I'm ex I'm really excited but also nervous. The reason why I'm nervous is because of needles and I freaking hate needles. Hmm. Also, can you guys hear the music fine? Uh, let me know if I need to turn it up a bit or turn turn it down a little. Oh crap, it's been long. It's been a long time since I played as Cassie in this one, in this game. I miss playing this game so much. I would say this game is a bit better than, uh... Mortal Kombat 11, in my opinion. Some people buy numbing cream and, and stuff, yeah. My mom told me that I might do that, or... I'm I'm getting it on my arm right here. I people told me it's the least uh, part that will hurt. Like it, it hurts the least because like there's pretty much like a lot of muscle and like flesh on that part of your body. So yeah. Ha! 
Right in the balls. Oh crap. No. Yes. Cassie wins. So yeah. Really excited but nervous. <laughs> Also, guys, um, if for the ones who have not heard this, um, my next, uh, game playthrough, Twitch commentary walkthrough, um, will be, uh, the story mode of Mortal Kombat X. Or Mortal Kombat XL, whatever you want to call it. So I'll be playing the story mode. The game after that, I'm not sure what game I'm gonna play. Hi, Muffy! How are you? Kicks right into Z Booty. You doing good? I'm doing all right. Thank you for asking. And I lost. <laughs> it's so good to see you as always, Moffy. I'm finally 18. Can you believe it? I do oh here we go been so busy lately sorry for now we're playing quickly it's fine Moffy it's understandable oh crap it's been a while since I played this game <laughs> you you're an adult now move out <laughs> ah no! Oh wait! Okay. I won! Okay, I thought I lost. Uh, this is a test your luck. Uh, hi, it's me. <laughs> anyway, I'm off <laughs> I'm, I might move out after I graduate, but I'm still figuring that out. There's this apartment I'm wanting to- I'm kinda wanting to move into. That my vet- well, my best friends live in. It's a pretty nice, um, apartment. Um, it's mostly for people who have, uh, disabilities and stuff. Like, for me, I have autism. I mean, it's not really in a, a disability. Some people say it is, but I would say it's kinda not. It's just a different learning ability and stuff, so... I might move in uh, after I graduate, or... I'm still figuring that out. <laughs> my mom said I can live with my parents forever, or whatever. But, I'll figure it out. That's awesome. Make sure you stay safe and pick the right people to be roommates with. Yeah, of course. Definitely. To be honest, autism is a superpower in my eyes. Oh, hell yeah. Thank you for the support, my brother. It's just that there are times where I, I wish I didn't have autism, but hey, it's just how it is, right? I've been diagnosed uh, since I was three, ish, or whatever. That's what my that's what my mom said though. Ugh, crap. Exactly, life goes on, and we have to go fit. Yeah, that is true. Oh yeah, um, how was the weather in Jordan, by the way? 
the weather. Stay home as long as you can and save as much money as possible. Yeah, that is true. My mom said um, that um, she can help me pay bills and stuff, help me with the bills and all that stuff. So that's that's cool. <laughs> Love the new camera, by the way. Oh, thank you. It's the PS5 camera. I'm playing on my PS5 at the moment. It's so hot. So hot. Do I ever come here? <laughs> oh, trust me, it's really hot in, in Kansas right now. But my mom said this weekend it's supposed to be a bit more cooler or something. Or sometime next week. Yes! Alright, so yesterday, um, I was at school, right, and we had we had to start wearing masks again for some reason. Uh, but um, there's there uh, like it's only temporary. It's uh, we started uh, yesterday, and like like uh, we wear them till the 12th or 13th. But, like I said, it's just only temporary uh, until they make a decision. Either that we should wear masks the whole year or not, or whatever. Um, so, you're say I wore the mask for the first time in, in months since... I haven't worn one since I got vaccinated back in May. And I was struggling to breathe, like, for real. And I was wearing jeans, and in my office aid class, I was delivering uh, passes to any class and stuff. I was walking and um, it was so freaking hot. I was dying. And, like I couldn't breathe uh, through the mask as well. Like I was struggling. But then today, um, as I started kind of getting using, started getting used to the masks again, and um, and I wore shorts today, and it, I felt so much better. This guy's a cage off is so weird. <laughs> oh, it's it's the Sub Zero cosplay uh, skin, but um, it, it this the color it is now it's the alternate color instead of blue. Masks are fun. Yeah, I agree with you. Like yesterday, I was like literally struggling. I'm like, how how the hell do you wear that thing again? <laughs> So yeah, usually for me, um, since I'm already vaccinated, fully vaccinated, um, even though I can still get the Delta uh, var variant COVID thing or whatever, but it's the symptoms are not um, worse as regular COVID symptoms are. Um, even though I can still get it, even though I'm, I'm fully vaccinated, but it's not as worse as uh, much as the people who aren't vaccinated. Um, I don't usually wear, wear a mask in public anymore. Like, ever since I got vaccinated, I haven't worn one since. But if I ever need to wear a mask, then I, then I will. But um, if I don't need to, then I won't. So, but that's just my opinion. But yeah, I've heard that the symptoms of... Um, the the Delta variant version of COVID or whatever uh, the symptoms it's not as worse as the the regular COVID is if you are vaccinated. But um, right now it's mostly infecting the people who aren't vaccinated. I got my second dose three days ago. Oh, how did you feel? Did you have any side effects? 
I remember when I, well, after I got my first dose and my second dose, I got a fever and I got chills from both of them for some reason. And for some reason, my parent, my parents did not have any some as side effects. They did not have a fever or did not have chills, but I did for some reason. Yep, I was so ill. Uh, trust me, for me, it was not fun. Alright, so after my first dose, um, the next day in the morning, I was just fine. And then uh, after lunch, during my third class, um, I, was, I was starting to have a headache. And I thought it was either my hair because I had my hair up, or I, I also had a hat on. I thought it was that, but my my fourth class, my last class, um, I fell asleep. It, it was in choir class, and um, I just pretty much fell asleep uh, during class. We weren't doing anything. We were just chilling, um, and, and all. And, um, when I got up, I was, I was kind of struggling to get up because I was feeling, uh, very crappy. And, um... And when I got home, um, I was feeling feverish and, um, I was having chills. It was not fun. And my arm was my my arm is sore as well, but for some reason, uh, after my second dose, um, my arm wasn't sore, but I still had a fever and I still had the chills. It was not fun at all. Oh, um, you can you can hear the music by the way, right? Do I need to turn it up a bit, or...? I'm struggling here. Okay, thank you for letting me know. And yeah, I had school on my birthday, and it was better than I expected, actually. Like, I remember before, I was like, ah, oh, I have school on my birthday, uh. And, um, actually, it was better than I expected. I got all the attention, I got all the birthday wishes and stuff. I even, I even had a uh, lunch with my two favorite teachers, which was fun. And after school, um, I spent time with fam- with family. So it was fun. I missed my birthday already, but my mom said that um, I'm still celebrating it technically because it's my birthday week. <laughs> um, on uh, well, tomorrow after school, I think I think my sister-in-law is gonna like take me to Starbucks, a nearby Starbucks or something, because I love Starbucks. And it, on Facebook, uh, we uh, I tagged her in this one post like. This app person ha has to uh, take take you to a coffee date or whatever. I was like, hey, how about we do Starbucks instead? <laughs> so yeah, we are going to Starbucks tomorrow after school, I think. And on Saturday, uh, my mom said that uh, we can have like a family dinner or something. And. On Sunday, we are going to, um, this little small, uh, zoo nearby. Like, that's like an hour away from, from where I live. It's called Tananika. It's a really fun, uh, little zoo. And, yeah. I think we're gonna, we're gonna go out, uh, for dinner after, uh, Tananika as well, so. Cool stuff. So I'm, I'm still technically, uh, celebrating. I always had birthdays on school days. Oh man. 
How were, how was that for you? <laughs> I remember back in elementary, uh, we would always had we would always bring treats uh, for our birthdays, and the whole class would have have treats. Elementary was fun and all. Um, I kind of like high school a bit better. <laughs> It sucked. Oh no, I'm sorry. Why- why is that? My most favorite part about having a birthday- birthdays on your- uh, My favorite part about having a birthday on a school day is getting all the attention and love. My least favorite part is, um, the classes, uh, going to the classes you don't like. Uh, I hate my core classes. It's because of the subjects and also because of anyone else in those classes. <sighs> it sucks. It really sucks. So that's why I pretty much uh, like my um, my electives better. I prefer to be stuck in my elective classes than my core classes. And you, you'll be turning 19 next month, right, Muffy? Muffy, you're old. <laughs> you're an old man. I'm kidding. <laughs> Katana, gotta play Katana. Katana. <laughs> yes, you're an old man. <laughs> oh no, your back hurts already? What'd you do to yourself? Have, have you even played or seen this game before? Mortal Kombat X? Or Mortal Kombat XL, whatever you want to call it. You worked your, your whole life? Oh man. I'm sorry. And what is your job, by the way? Like, um, what are you, uh, working for, uh, currently? You had XL on your PS4? Uh. Oh yeah. I kinda like this game better than Mortal Kombat X. Oh, what? No, no. I kinda like this uh, game more than Mortal Kombat 11 in my opinion. Hey Thunder, how are you? I wasn't playing too wide, that's your back hurt. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. Alright. That's good to hear that you're good. I'm doing alright. My birthday was two days ago, so I'm officially 18 now. Alright, so the reason why I would say Mortal Kombat X or Mortal Kombat XL, whatever you want to call it, is a bit better. Is because, um, it's a bit more faster and, um, there's other reasons why. <laughs> but anyway, let's go ahead and do some karaoke. I have figured out what song I'm going to sing. Um, 
I'm going to sing Almost There from the movie The Princess and the Frog, the Disney this movie. <laughs> Wish me luck, I really, I really love this song. And Tiana is one of my favorite Disney princesses. Wish me luck. <laughs> <laughs> What's that email about, Mothy? Uh, Bud the Rip, thank you for the follow, by the way. <laughs> Go back into hiding. Back to the game. But yeah, Thunder, uh, how is everything going so far? How is the UK? Turn that down a little. <clears throat> Oh, Mothy, did I mention that- did I mention to you that I'm getting my tattoo next week on Wednesday? Oh, crap. Yeah, I'm- I'm getting it next week. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Oh, there we go. I am excited and nervous at the same time. I hate needles so much. <laughs> yeah, that is crazy.
Yeah, I'm really excited to show it. I really am. I'm excited to see how it turns out. And, um, from the drawing that I showed you before, um, the font is going to be different. Um, I'm, tr I'm kind of thinking like a cyber life uh, font-ish or whatever, if I can find anything that's similar. While I was drawing it, I was trying to find like a cyber life uh, font on the internet and I couldn't find it, so I just decided to go with cursive a little, but um, my mom said that I should change the font and I kind of agreed with it and it would have matched the, the tattoo a bit more, so hopefully I can find a font that's almost like cyber life-ish. What is my parents' opinion about it? Um, my mom is... She seems excited about it. And my dad, um... He is kind of nervous about it. The reasoning, I think, is because, um... He's afraid that, like, I'm not gonna regret it or something. Like, which is understandable. But, um, I've made my decision, so... That's that. <laughs> But that's just me. And that's just him, so, yeah. The classic. How about you, Muffy? Do you ever d decide to get a tattoo or not? Thank you, Muffy. I'll, I'll definitely send it to you when it once it's finished. But yeah, I hate needles. I'm always afraid of needles, especially when it comes to shots. But hey, I know it's different. And my mom says that um you c you cannot see the needle uh, once the tattoo gun is like. Once the needle is like, like bouncing up and down on your skin. <laughs> I can't get one. Tattoos are forbidden in Islam, my religion. Oh man, I'm sorry. So like in in Jordan, like uh, you guys can't get tattoos, or or is it just like your your personal religion or whatever? If you don't mind me asking. It's okay. That's okay. I never wanted one. Oh, okay. <laughs> I mean, hey, that's just you. You do you. It's your body. But yeah, like I told you, Mafi, um, I got a part in uh, Legally Blonde. I'm playing as uh, one of the sa uh, the sales girl uh, in the department uh, scene <laughs> in the department uh, store ensemble. I have I have a few lines. It goes by love, love the new Franklin's from Chanel. That's that's my what my lines are. <laughs> I'm actually excited and, and also nervous because it's my first time having lines in a musical besides uh, the play. I had I had the lines in, in my first spring play back in uh, March. It was so it was so much fun to work on and I'm also really excited to uh, work on a legally blonde. It's gonna it's gonna be so cool. I already know it. Because of all the different ensembles and stuff, and um, of all uh, those fabulous, that fabulous, that fabulous vibe. Because it's legally blonde, a lot of pink, and a lot, and a blonde. Whatever. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not a pink, a huge pink person, but it's okay. It's just not my favorite. It's too girly.
I'll get to you right in a minute, in a second, Mafi. I don't mind you asking, you can get tattoos. The thing is, in Islam, God gave us this body and we have to return it to God the same way we got it. And tattoos alter that. Oh. Okay. I mean, hey, like I said, you do you. Your body. <laughs> That uh, skin of Melina. Yeah, I like Melina's teeth better in this one than Mortal Kombat 11 and Mortal Kombat 9. It looks more human-like, even though she's not human. She's she has that uh, she's a Tarkatan. <laughs> Mafi, I remember you saying that, um, uh, the Mortal Kombat character, I'm mostly, uh, I'm, yeah, sorry. I remember you saying, um, the Mortal Kombat character, uh, that reminds me, uh, that you reminds you of me is Melina. I remember that. I forgot, I forgot, uh, you said why. I think it's because she's crazy and I'm crazy, or, um, I forgot the reasoning. Ah, uh, crap. I lost. Tasty. Like I said, been a while since I played this game. hate my computer. Hang on. Ugh, oh, for God's sake. Oh, sorry about that. I hate my computer. Please don't do that again. Alright. It's okay, Mothy. Um, I was talking about, uh, the one- I remember one time that you, uh, I asked you which Mortal Kombat character reminds you of me, and you said that, um, <laughs> well, Melina reminds you of, of me or whatever, for some reason. Probably gonna have to. <sighs> Probably gonna have to read the chats on my phone just in case. Sorry about that, you guys. Except my computer sucks. Whoop, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Probably gonna turn the turn the game music back on. Don't worry about it. refresh the page on your PC. I might try to do that. I hate my computer. This computer sucks. So annoying. It's always so slow and it always does this kind of crap. I remember uh, last month, or no, not last month, in July, uh, when I went to Colorado, 
my brother-in-law gave me another laptop. Um, it's not an HP. Um, it's still one of those other kinds of uh, laptops. I've uh, I'm whenever I see someone with a Apple laptop, or um, a MacBook, I always complain like, "Hey, mom, I wish I had one of those laptops." She's like, "Sorry." And oh yeah, I got uh, my brother-in-law gave me a Dell laptop. I'm like uh, I want I want an Apple laptop, but nope. Like my sister, she literally has one of the one of those Mac MacBooks. I'm like I wish I had one. <laughs> no. And my mom said they're like thousands of dollars or something or whatever. Oh, shut up, Lothi. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm joking. Um. What else was I gonna say? I might. I'm. Right now, we're trying to find a charger for, uh, the Dell laptop that my brother-in-law gave me. Um. If I ever u decide to use it, um, I might, I might play, a, a game on it. <laughs> I might play Friday 13th on it or whatever. But, um. Or I could really use it for my streaming or whatever. Or just, just whatever. How Depends how I feel about it, or like what up, what other stuff I could use it for and stuff. <laughs> why? Why? Um. Why are they a waste of money? Question mark. I need a laptop for college. I'm starting college soon. Oh, nice! I heard that you that you finally graduated. Congrats! I'm graduating this year. <laughs> That's crazy. I'm a se I'm officially a senior at school. My very last year of high school. And I'm still figuring out either to go to college or not. And yes, I'm in that math class. I had to take a math class my, this year, this semester. Yeah, it's required to take a math class during your, during your senior year if you're wanting to go to college, which is stupid. But, hey, I thought, why not take it just in case? Get it over with so maybe I, and so I could go to college if I decide to. Waste some money because for one thousand dollars you can get a way a way better Windows laptop. It's just that the thing is I'm not a big fan of the Windows laptops. It's because they're pretty slow. And yeah, but that's that's just my opinion though. I don't know what to do here. Okay, so the chats are beginning to work now on my laptop. Let's just go ahead and do chill music again. Pretty slow because the one you have has old parts in it. <laughs> What am I gonna do with you? Go with Kung Lao. Why not? I haven't played him in a long time. Wow. Just like how an iPhone 11 is better than an iPhone 6, but it's new. Not that iPhones are good either. <laughs> I have an iPhone. I got an iPhone 7 Plus, and I had 
I've had it ever since 2017 and it still works. That's crazy. Four years. It it can glitch a bit sometimes, but um at least it still works. If you want speed, don't get him back. What? <laughs> How do you even know? <laughs> have you even had one before? <laughs> you you have a laptop, don't you? If so, which one do you have? How do you know all this? <laughs> Did someone you you know have one or what? Because your sister has one? Oh. Oh hey, brutality. I worked at Best Buy before. <laughs> I'm a tech savvy. <laughs> I can tell. Isn't that what you're wanting for your career, right? Wait, or is it engineering? Could you, uh, remind me of what you're wanting to do for a career? You told me before. Test your luck. Round one. Fight. Oh, my brother-in-law? He's the best... best at tech. Like, literally, uh, at, at my sister's house? And he literally has a, a freaking setup, like, with, like, monitors and, like, a PC and crap. And, a All that kind of stuff, that's what I'm wanting, t what I'm wanting for, um... That's how I want my streaming to be, like, a full setup, like, monitors and a PC and crap, and I can... Hook up to m hook up my uh my console and crap. That would be cool. You're studying cy cyber security engineering. Oh, nice. What I'm wanting for my career, um, I'm wanting to be a s uh, an actress and a singer. So yeah, um, I've been I've been practicing my acting a lot recently, and um, I've been uh, improving my acting. Like I'm wanting to get in, into voice acting as well because I just think it's so fun. Like literally, almost pretty much every day I practice my acting. And yeah, um, that's what I want to do for my career. Um, so yeah, I've been, been I've been improving my acting a lot. Even my uh my theater teacher agrees. <laughs> oh crap. I should probably reload this again. Refresh this. Right when I was talking about my theater acting crappy. Computer problems. Probably 
Read the chats from my computer again. Hey Anna, I gotta go. I had fun talking with you. Good night. It's 1.25 a.m. Oh, it's okay, Mafi. Um, it's almost, uh, the stream is about to be over in a few minutes anyway. But, anyway, um, I'll s talk to you tomorrow. If you like to, and if you can. Much love, brother. See you later, Muffy. <laughs> oh yeah, my dad and this and this uh uh chapter girl, what's call it? Um that um the map thing or whatever, my dad, whenever he would always watch me play this game, he'd always get mad at me about throwing the old lady. <laughs> like, oh, why you throw the old lady? <sighs> uh, don't, throw the, don't throw the old lady, don't throw the old lady. Oh, why'd you throw the old lady? <laughs> mm, excuse me. Got hiccups. Excuse me. Oh, I have not played Alien in a long time, either. There we go. Yes, guys, I know I'm doing the same move, but it's been a long time since I played those Kung Lao in this game. <laughs> Johnny Cage. <laughs> Oh yeah, Johnny Cage. Uh, my dad will always call him a douchebag, <laughs> which he kind of is of a, of a douchebag, but he's also really funny. He would always say Johnny douchebag. <laughs> oh, here's Johnny douchebag. <laughs> and it was so funny. I would always laugh. He, for some reason, he would always give a. Uh, most of the Okama characters' uh, names. Um, my dad will always call Takita Taco Bell or Taquito or whatever. <laughs> it was so funny. A Taco Bell. <laughs> the taco Bell does not serve tacos. They serve dog food. It's just that funny video that I watch all the time. The Sonic Zombies. The Sonic Zombies series. You should check it out on YouTube, it's- they're hilarious. <laughs> Ooh! Ah! I got to beep! Oh man, I gotta go poop! <laughs> <laughs> it's they're so hilarious. If you don't you guys don't know what I'm talking about, uh, go and check them out on YouTube. Just search up so uh, Sonic Zombie videos and um it's, they're just hilarious. <laughs> The Sonic the Hedgehog. 
But yeah, um, I'm talking about Sonic the Hedgehog. I, there's this one YouTuber that created this uh, this series of Sonic Zombie videos or whatever. <laughs> They're so hilarious. Okay. Alright, so that is gonna be it for two guys, and we are now gonna do the raid. Who should we raid today? I think we have raided uh, Fallout 3 uh, before, so let's just go ahead and raid this person. They're playing uh, Fallout 3 right now. Cool stuff. Such a good game. But yeah, recently I, I am currently taking a break from Fallout 4 as I'm lost right now. But I would love to stream uh, Fallout 3 on stream someday. I think I would say if, if the third one's a bit more better than um, four, in my opinion. But anyway, that is gonna be it for you guys. I'll see you guys next time on Saturday for episode four of Batman Telltale, The Enemy Within season two on Saturday. And um, my Instagram is Hannah Powers DBH Deviant. My Twitter is at Hannah the HP 600. And my Twitch is Hannah Powers to HP 600, which is you're on right now. And my YouTube channel is Hannah Powers Goes Deviant, so go check that out. And let's do my outro. My name is Hannah. I am one of them. This is our story. And thank you guys for joining. I'll see you guys next time for Batman. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your Thursday. And keep gaming. Bye!